Oh, guys. Holy cow, look at that. <laughs> Yo, what up, guys? Welcome to another toy hunt video. It is 71 degrees. Really nice out in the city of Chicago. <gasps> okay, guys, I'm doing this again. I'm recording these... I'm these. I'm recording this intro at the end of the video because, um, yeah, it's been a long one, guys. That's what she said. <laughs> I've been to so many targets, and we found a lot of stuff. T2E2 just happened, and also the garage sale for Mass Collectibles. If you guys missed that, uh, check out my videos. So all this stuff happened like in between those two. So timeline is super jumpy, but I want to catch you guys up on the last couple of weeks of hunt so like I said a longer video so you guys definitely been telling me you guys enjoy these types so also guys a lot of movement in this video regarding the changes of the toy room so I know you guys wanted to see that as well you guys can pretty much catch up on the progress so at the end of the video you'll see how we're looking but I know you guys enjoy toy room updates as well so stick around anyways what are we hunting we're looking for a lot of stuff guys I got a lot of stuff in the mail that came in uh, from Sleeping Collectibles, so stay tuned to the end. I got I got a figure from him, and I also got a couple of other things in the mail as well. But we did get a couple of goodies here, so I know you guys will enjoy that. But anyways, guys, make sure you do drop a like. It does help promote the channel, and make sure you sub if you're new. All right, let's see over there. Oh. Okay, folks, uh, this is gonna be one of those you know the random clips that I tag in an extra video. Oh my God, look at this. <laughs> lunch boxes. What do you want? Lunch boxes. We got Leia. We got Tikas for days. What do we got here? Oh, snap. Oh, Gree. He's gonna be our, not Gree, Grief Cargo. He's gonna be at uh, C2E2. It's actually C2E2 Saturday right now. So I'm actually here because I need to run some errands. So. Let's just check out real quick what they got. It looks like they do get the new they did get the new stuff here. Because I do see the triceratops. So that's cool. Buzz Lightyear. I saw that movie. It was alright. Um, I actually kind of fell asleep <laughs> halfway through it, but lots of T-Rexes here. We got the Pixar. Let's see, what do we have here? Oh we got Ahsoka. Oh, you know what? I am gonna get her signature, so is this box better? A little bit better. You know, I actually might have to grab that. Dengar. Man, I wish they had the other figures. Oh, we got Mr. T here. Lots of Mr. T's. Got X Pac. Ah, oh, look at this. Wow, that's cool. First time I've seen Galen Urso. And Talk Merrick. Darth Vader. Fifth brother. Obi Wan. I'm still looking for Obi Wan, so I actually think I'm going to grab this one because I do need to get her signature on a better figure because mine is all jacked up. So I think uh, we'll do that. Oh, let's see here. We got the new that's what stuff. Okay, so this is the ATST. It's uh, no chases. Dang. Okay. Well, all good. It's cool to see these. Put that back. Uh, I don't see the micro squadron ones, but this is cool to see. So we'll for sure, I think, grab this one. This one's in better condition than the other one. Little dot right there. But mine is like a little more frayed. And we were gonna, we were talking about buying another one at C2E2. But um, I'll release that video after, so make sure you do uh, subscribe so you guys can see it. But this is kind of tempting. But yeah, this is the chase that I missed out on last time. Look at that. <sighs> shame, shame, shame. But yeah, we'll grab her. Uh, let's see if there's anything else here. Go check. Let's work on the other side. Look at these DC. These are probably on sale. Got some Marvel Legends here. Oh, look at that. Black Panther. Looking good. Killmonger. Yeah, look at this. I love seeing new stuff here. This box is way better than mine. I should uh, pick that up, but we'll leave it. It's all good. Got saber tooth up there. Oh, look at this! Some of the new DC with the comics. Superman. Good to see Superman. What else we got? Batman. Well, it looks like we got Black Adam here. Take a look. What else have we got here? Got anyone else? 
Black Adam, Dr. Fates, Cyclone, and Hammer Smasher. So, there you go. That's cool. We'll see. Yeah, take a look at that. But, yeah, I'll make sure to post that on the Instagram so you guys can see it. Uh, but, good deal. Wow, good stuff. But, uh, yeah. Oh, look at this. We got a gold label. Uh, homeboy here, Manhunter. So, it's good. Good to see. Let's post all these up. We're gonna make a, we're gonna take a screenshot. This will be the next, this will be the next, uh, <laughs> thumbnail here. So, there you go. Let's do that. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna post this on my Instagram, at nolan.collects. So, make sure you're following me there. But, pretty cool to see this stuff. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. Okay, folks. So, I'm just showing you a quick update. We got potato over here. But we're building this uh, desk here, this standing desk. We got two of them. One is downstairs, but one's upstairs. But this is from Walmart, actually. Picked it up for like 189 bucks. So we're gonna see if this is actually any good. But it's like two slabs of wood here. These look pretty good, in my opinion. But I think this is actually the fun thing, or the cool thing, is like they tell you which ones, which screws to use. And they actually separate them, like here, A, B, C, D. So it actually makes it a little bit easier. But yeah, you know, that's about it. Uh, I'm gonna stick one of these desks over there, and then I think we're gonna get the other one. I'm probably gonna have to move a lot of this stuff over there. Haven't touched this stuff yet, and actually, probably see some of the C2 E2 haul here. I am gonna record this after, so we're time jumping. Okay, folks, we're here, my local Target, just looking at stuff. <laughs> uh, we got Saw Guerrero over here, we got Anakin, lots of three and three quarters. Uh, we got Asajj Ventress, but over here we got. Luke Skywalker X-Wing and Darth Vader. So um, I'm gonna leave Vader for now, but I actually might pick this up because it's jacked up and I kinda wanna open one and keep one sealed because I don't know why. Having the launch edition, series one, feels like, you know, feels like it's gonna be worth something down the line. So I might try to keep some mint on card and just grab like a second pair because I do wanna open it. <laughs> kids, kids screaming. <laughs> um, yeah, I was also looking at the cherry stair tops, uh, but I won't pick it up today. I think I'm gonna be a long game with that. Okay, guys, I said screw it. I'm grabbing both of these because the boxes are kind of janked up, so don't feel bad opening them because I do want to open some and keep some sealed. So there we go. Okay, guys, I'm just adding this in a video later. Uh, I'm still editing the C2E2 video right here, but take a look at this wallpaper, guys. Like, this is cool. This came with the Millennium Falcon, so. We're putting like the ships here. I think this is like a cool little display piece. Like, look at that. This is perfect for these two. How crazy is that? I'm enjoying it. I'm loving these things, guys. Okay, folks. Uh, NECA didn't have anything and it was pretty full. So uh, we're just gonna check here real quick. We got Transformers and Power Rangers. Nothing new. <laughs> Nothing new for DC either. We do have these little comics here. So, kind of cool to see. Uh, Marvel, Marvel Legends. Oh, look at this. We got uh, Darwin here, Margaret, <laughs> some other stuff, Siren. Pretty good. Got some Black Panther stuff here. Star Wars, what you got for me? Oh, we got Vader. <laughs> we got Figure and Dan. Look at that. That's cool. Let's see. Oh, what do we have here? Squadrons. I've been obsessed with these lately. Two Vaders. And that's oh okay so this is pretty tempting um i do want to get one eventually we got leia pretty good um thinker it's a thinker let's see and i like i just see these and it just makes me want to army build them <laughs> we got vader here we got reva we did meet her she was really nice uh c2e2 so i'll add that uh at the end of future, uh, well, sorry, wow. Finish your thoughts. I'll add that link to C2E2 in the description below. So I'm gonna hold on to these two. We're just gonna be a maybe on these, but I don't see the little micro things, which is what I was kind of hoping for, but it's all good. Those little guest pass, the little thingies. Wow, Never mind, guys, sorry. Um, let's see, back here. Dress World, end caps. It's always good to check end caps. Uh, freaking uh, 
Destiny's Child is yelling so loud, so I'm gonna have to try to talk over this or like increase the music because it's kind of crazy. Pokemon, not much there. Uh, let's see, what do we got here for Halo? I know some of y'all Halo fans want to see some of this stuff, so what do we got here for Halo? All the same things here. Let's see, Halo, that's all I see here. Um, I wouldn't know what to find, to be honest with you, but some of you guys have been asking me, oh, look at this. Hey, here we go. That's pretty cool to see. Um, so I think these two things, you guys are trying to find these, so I'll post them on my Instagram, uh, at nolan.collect, so make sure you follow me there. All right, bear back. All right, guys, walk with me. It's a little windy out. Chicago traffic is crazy. I'm not sitting in traffic, I'm walking. It's a nice day. But uh, I do have a lot of new subscribers out there. If you're not following me on Instagram, at nolan.collects, I actually tag almost every single location uh, that I'm hunting at so trying to help out all the Chicago hunters out there all the collectors out there There's a lot of harder figures to find so I try to tag and get a good amount of stuff for you guys out there Because we got to help each other out, right? So uh, tag me if you guys end up picking up anything that you know, I shoot out there So uh, I usually try to repost you too as well You know, I try to repost everyone because yeah, we want to celebrate our wins So but anyways Make sure you follow me at Nolan Dacolex. All right, see you. Okay, so I saw someone on like a ball post this. These stands right here. This is like that little five dollar. Like this, when you walk in to a Target, they have these. So he put his figures. Whoops. He put. <laughs> sorry, a card in the back. Uh, they put their figures on these, like as little stands. So uh, I think I'm gonna try this out. We'll see if we like this. Okay, guys. I'm here at my local Target again. <gasps> oh, guys. Holy cow, look at that. We got a chase. We got the Luke Skywalker chase. Look at that. Oh, that's freaking awesome. Oh yeah, we're scooping. <laughs> Let me see what else we got here. Oh, just the regular ones too. Okay, that's cool. Wow, I was actually just gonna hit record. I, it's after work and I'm running around, but dude, look at that. Let's freaking go, yes. Holy freaking restocks, Batman. Look at these Pokemon cards. We got these EVs over here. Lots of packs here. Might grab a couple for my fiance. She's having a rough day, so I wanna help her out. But look at this, guys. Oh, snap. Look how sick that is. <laughs> I honestly kinda wanna grab this and just, oh my God, that's cool. Wow. We got a couple here. Um, yeah, look how look how kind of sick that is. That's that's awesome. Love this. Um, yeah, you know, I think I'll grab this for her, even though I kind of like the Mewtwo, but I'll let her open up all these packs. I kind of just want this right here. <laughs> uh, but yeah, pretty awesome. Okay, folks. Wow. So this is like my first night that I am able to start working on the toy room. So. Uh, tonight I just released the C2E2 video, so if you didn't check that out, make sure you do. All three days, full-on convention, it was such a blast, and yeah guys, I mean, I really had a lot of fun with that, so I get to finally start cleaning up, but uh, before I do that, I do want to build this shelf, so I think I'm going to be doing that tonight. And uh, before I even start unboxing, what I think my game plan is, is I want to get my shelf situation set up first because I don't think I'm going to start unboxing everything like a lot of the stuff over there. We'll go over everything, guys. I'm going to take you uh, along with me with every step of the way here, but I want to make sure that the shelving is set first. We got to make sure that the foundation is set, so okay. Folks, we are finally done building this. It actually didn't take that long. Maybe about a good 20 minutes or so. But now what I'm going to do is I'm going to swap this over here. And I'm actually going to move that out of this room. So, okay. Here we go. Here's a quick update on just how it looks so far. So, um, we're going to be replacing a lot of these boxes. I mean, these boxes are going to get unpacked. A lot of them are just like sets that are already built that I'm going to probably have to piece together a little bit. Because I'm pretty sure some of them broke in transit. But... <laughs> Here you go. So this is the idea at least is to get this going. So maybe we'll put the floating shelves up top. I do have Let's see how many I got four right here. So maybe we'll do the three across just long way 
that might be nice and then like one stacked up top like up there maybe i don't know i really don't want to drill into the wall until i know the actual layout here so okay guys i just want to show you a quick little test run here so not the way i wanted it obviously i'm just putting whatever i had here for now because we still got to unpack this but i just wanted to see how it looked if i started to uh display things so we got like the black panther and some of my other figures up here some of the signed stuff from c2e2 here we go a lot of this stuff you're actually going to see me pick it up in this video which i'm going to be including this clip and then um here you go like that beast wars and we got the jurassic world down here in the bottom i kind of like this okay here are how the stands look like you guys can let me know what you think so it's not bad um i just posted this on my instagram if you're following me you probably saw this already but you know just some late night action with the mythic legion so hey guys it's the next day i uh, just wanted to show you guys the closet space that we're working with it's actually really spacious so uh, I think what I'm going to do for a little bit is probably move a lot of like the Lego, uh, these things right here, excuse me dogs, move these, I'm going to take these out of the wrapper, actually I'll keep them in there for now, but I'm going to put all these in the closet uh, for now, so we're going to organize some Lego so I can prioritize a lot of the action figures on the shelves. We want to clear the shelves out for now. Uh, I'm gonna sort this a little bit. I'm probably gonna push the UCS sets on the side. We will start building these soon I'm really excited about that now. We got time to build these so but before we do all that we want to get organized So guys, so here we go. Just a little bit of an update here We're gonna be moving these chairs in lieu of getting our chairs tonight, but uh, pretty much took all the Lego stuff and we put them in here and if you guys just want to see how it looks so far how we organized uh, it's not bad not bad at all hey folks so i just wanted to whip out some figures and i think i'm going to take out the mythic legions first so this box is just filled with miscellaneous stuff which i'm gonna probably get rid of at some point like the um the hot wheels at least but look at this oh snap we got aether i can't wait to take this guy out soon i'm gonna start laying these out we also got some over here you guys want to take a look at what we got i've opened him already krona same with the, uh, what's his name, Borthog. This is actually one of my favorite ones. We also got this one, which I picked up at Kane County, King Noglin. He is awesome. I can't wait to display this guy. I love my green army. I got a bunch of bad guys. I also got a bunch of knights. And that's really just what I love about, you know, the Mythic Legions is just like the fantasy aspect of these figures. They're just so cool. So here you go, Hadriano. It fills that aspect of my collection because, you know, I like Star Wars, I like Marvel, but I also just really love fantasy stuff. So, played World of Warcraft for like 14, 15 years. So, uh, that's kind of just ingrained in me. I don't, I don't play D and D or anything, but you know, I think these are pretty cool. Oh, this is my knight that's still sealed. I haven't touched this guy yet. I'm gonna use him for trade later. We also got Tibius over here. He's looking good. A lot of these should be pretty familiar if you guys followed me for a minute. You guys know I've been collecting Mythic Legions uh, since like December last year. So I jumped in pretty late when the Poxus wave started uh, coming out. But yeah, here we go. We got the Fury Orc. He looks pretty cool. Here we go. We got uh, was this the Hellfire Goblin. I thought this one's pretty cool. Yeah, I like him. A lot of people army build with this guy. Uh, we also got a Sir Gerard here. This one's sealed. And I'm actually going to take this with me to uh new jersey when we go to legions con i'm gonna get jeremy gerard to sign this because this figure was based off him the last one up here oh wait what do we got here oh we got another black knight here i just want to make sure oh sir owen this is actually one of my first mythic legion figures and then here guys this is a really special figure and i actually made a video on this uh if you want to scroll through my videos this is the test shot so this is a a prototype belphegor so uh, they had a small window where you guys could order these it literally you literally had a second to click 
and check out. And I got super lucky because these go for such a high price. I think I only paid 37 bucks for this. And it's going, these go for like 250, 300, 500 plus. So yeah, I'm really excited. This is basically just a part of the history of Four Horsemen because this is literally one of their prototype figures before they put them into production. So I always think this is pretty cool. This is awesome. What up, potato? Okay, let's sort through here real quick. I think I got a couple more figures. Oh. And hopefully you guys don't mind this. Let me know in the comments. I'm I'm just going to tag this in a video. So, But here we go. This is Magnus. I haven't opened him up yet. He looks pretty cool. Uh, I don't know what it is. I can't remember what this faction is. But yeah, he's pretty cool. I'm liking him. I can't wait to open him up too. I think I'm going to put all my Mythic Legions in a detail, but I, I think I do need to have like some Dio pieces because I want to display them properly. I might have like three or four shelves of them like dedicated. I might have like all that dedicated to Mythic Legions, if you ask me. I got a ton of them on pre-order and then I'm going to order a ton of them uh, for right now where they have the uh, they have one of the waves out right now. Which one is it? Um, wow. Anyway. Yeah, there is there's a pre-order window open now for some figures, but here we go. We got Aether. He was one of the four horsemen. One of the first ones I have in hand. I have the I have Poxes pre-ordered and I have Alithia coming in. So we'll have three out of the four. And those are all the ones that are announced right now. But this guy is just freaking badass. <laughs> Last one, and I think you guys saw me pick this up a long time ago. One of the Toy Cons. We got the Barbarian Builder. This was a grail piece for a lot of people. This was one of the figures from the reinforcement wave. So he was originally $55 if you wanted to order one. And um, yeah, after market, he was going for like $200, $300, $400. Today, Junior? <laughs> I think I picked him up at a toy con for like under 100 bucks. So got pretty lucky there. But yeah, it's really cool to have him, especially with all those accessories. So hey okay okay here we go so these are most of my sealed figures um i did look in one of the bins i got a bunch of loose orcs and stuff in there so i think i might like lay them out somewhere just so we can see how the army looks but man it feels really good to start busting these out guys like oh my god i'm feeling so hype because i get to finally start playing with the freaking toys it's been like way 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 too long hey guys there's a backstage here but we're at macy's look at this toys r us how freaking crazy guys we are back toys r us are back in macy's so um i haven't been here in a minute they were setting up previously so scanning i do see some stuff over here so why don't you guys walk with me let's walk and talk shall we all right, let's see. Look at the legends. We got some legends here. How much are you guys going for? Can't tell. Can't tell, but um, if I do need gore, got Valkyrie here. Good stuff. We got here some of this uh, retro figures. Ooh, oh my God, they got symbiote Spider-Man right here. Look at that. Pretty cool, Ben Riley. Man, look at that. Oh, jackpot. That's nice. That's cool. Hobgoblin. That's a cool figure. Do I want that? I don't know. I want to collect the bad guys, actually. So, do I want to grab these right now? Maybe. But that's cool. We got, we got Ben Riley. We got the Marvel. We got a couple, so it looks like they got just stacked up in here. That's cool. Good to see. So, I'm going to maybe on these. Um not gonna lie i just passed this this is pretty cool it's a little hogwarts model we got a little play set like they don't make enough of those nowadays you know you know what, guys i just noticed it's pretty funny that i'm picking up these figures because look at the shirt that i'm wearing right now oh spider-man <laughs> okay folks we are here late night visit at target look at this look at all these galen ursos and talk merricks also got a bunch of Tikas and uh, Landos, Tuscan Raiders, uh, Saw Guerreras, Casca, Migs. Pretty good. Pretty good stash of stuff so far. Millennium Falcon. Oh, speaking of which, I need to buy batteries for that thing. Uh, yeah, look at that. 
Oh my god, I thought I saw a Chase sticker for a second. That was not, not that. Okay. Um, gonna go look on the other side, but yeah, nothing else here really, so. Okay. The dog. We got some Pokemon there. My my fiance found an EV plush, so trouble. Uh, Excuse me. Oh, there, there she goes. There she goes. <laughs> uh, let's pick up this. But we got some Marvel Legends here. Just looking, we got maggots, Nakia. Oh, we got tons of Mbaku's. I might have to grab another when it goes on sale. But let me uh, walk around. I'm actually holding this left-handed now. Yeah, Superman. The Black Adam comic version. That is a cool looking Spider-Man. I mean, Superman, wow. Look at that. <laughs> I'm wearing a Spider-Man shirt. Look at this, guys. We got Martian Hunter. We also got a Cyclone. Oh, look at this. I think this is new, too. Wild Force. Interesting. Look at that. We got, we got tons of these guys here. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Bunch of Yoshis. That'd be sick. Oh my gosh, look at this. We got Spider-Man helmet here. That's kind of cool to see. I haven't seen that. Oh, interesting. Oh, that's heavy. I should actually, we should actually scan that and see if it's on sale because that might be on sale. Okay, guys, moment of truth. Let's see it. 124. <gasps> okay, guys, take a look. Jada, Fast and the Furious, Toretto's home. Is this scale with the figures? Because uh, we might actually have to scoop, but it looks all jacked up. So, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna grab it because this box is all messed up. But look at that, pretty cool. Jeez, another one, right here. Worse. Oh cow. Yeah, these are not in great condition, but that's really cool to see. <laughs> Last thing here. Look at this Groot. That's awesome. Love that. <laughs> all right, I think we're gonna get out of here now. Okay, friends and family, welcome back to the cantina. Is that right? Is that what we're calling it now? The cantina. We got to put our sign up, but we're back in the toy room in the apartment, and it's been a long video. Uh, my boys fell down, but ignore them. We'll pick them back up. But you know what? We're going to wrap up this video now because this has gone way too long, and it's way overdue. So um, I don't remember exactly which ones I picked up this uh this episode but i did get that chase over here like i said this is not how the display is gonna look like this is just what i had out of the boxes i was just putting stuff in the shelf so disclaimer there you know i don't want to hear it in the comments that you know i shouldn't be doing it this way but we got a couple of things here we got the atst we got the uh obi-wan jedi starfighter we got the tie fighter back there and i think we got another x-wing just to have mint on card so i have one open i have vader's open right over there the millennium falcon which we got batteries somewhere we'll have to put batteries in this thing because yeah i didn't know that guys look at that there's buttons to make it all soundy so you can like fly them around and swish them and whatever millennium falcon noises there are out there <laughs> yeah and then we got the chase there so that's the awesome pick there but we got some packages here guys we got some packages but before we get to that i just want to show these two figures off so finally bit the bullet got shocker because we are going to grab a lot of the bad guys for spider-man so shocker that uh toys r us is at macy's right guys what okay anyway uh we also got the hobgoblin here he's looking good so we'll crack both these bad boys open keep them lined up with rhino so pretty awesome uh i did open this already just to make sure because i wanted to make sure it arrived okay take this out what the frick it's on the floor okay i thought i was gonna need two hands but i don't boom all right here we go we got the razor crest look at that launch edition my gosh so this thing is too cool i really don't want to open it <laughs> So that means I might just have to order a second one to open it. I don't know. So we are missing the uh, Starship class of uh, Slave 1. So we definitely need to get that. I think that's in Walmart, but you get this one on Amazon. So if you really want this one, check Amazon. They, these aren't, as far as I know, still, uh, sold at Targets. So yeah. Okay, so we got three packages. We're going to start off with Big Bad Toy Store. Okay. Big Bad Toy Store sticker, and I think I mentioned this in my last video, but we got 
the New Republic security droid. So, uh, package looks really good. Pretty minty fresh, but uh, if you guys recall a couple of hunt videos ago, I did uh, a gore ago. Uh, I had a big bad toy store order, and I actually ordered this, and the box came like super jacked up and ripped. So uh, I shot that picture out to Big Bad Toy Store, and luckily they had more in stock, and they actually sent this one to me for free. So thank you, Big Bad Toy Store. That is crazy good customer service there. So happy about that. Okay, guys. I'll be honest with you that I don't remember what the frick I ordered in here. So this package has been sitting here for a minute, but I'm gonna assume it's something Star Wars related, if I had to guess. Oh, Disney. Oh, I think I know what this is, guys. Let's see. Let's see. Yep, yep, here we go. Take a peek. Look at that, guys. Oh, snap, this looks so good. The Nalon Chill. So I actually ordered two originally, but I canceled. And I just decided to order one because this was such an overkill price. <laughs> if I want any more, I'm just going to grab uh, the single version because it's the same figure. This one, you just get the extra stuff here. So, yeah, I mean, this looks awesome. I love this thing. I love everything about it. Yeah, we are. Uh, I was just talking about my fiance. I'm really excited to whip out the Black Series and opening back up the Cantina. So, we're gonna start that one off fresh, but look at this, guys. We got another band member. Let's go. Hey, guys, and we got a special package right here. What's up, Solo? You wanna help me open this? So this one's actually from Sleeping Collectibles. And uh, yeah, he had a sale post a little while ago because he was trying to fund a project that he was doing. So uh, yeah, I was able to help him out because he had something that I was looking for. Let's crack this open. Okay, here we go, guys. Let's take a look. Ooh, I'm really excited about this. Solo, what do you think? Are you excited? Oh, snap. Look at this. We got John Bernthal's Punisher. Freaking awesome. Let's go. Thank you, man. This looks so good. So I've been looking for this for a minute, and yet it is such a good price shift. I mean, what a deal. So not bad at all, guys. A little bit of everything here, but... Got some of these squadrons, they're pretty cool. We got a chase here, pretty freaking epic. Awesome Spider-Man figures from Toys R Us. Check your Macy's guys, because that's pretty crazy. The free figure from Big Bad Toy Store because my other one came damaged. Sleeping Collectibles, thanks again for the hookup. Freaking awesome, really glad to have him and him together. Look at that, guys, oh snap, that's awesome. Then we also got the nail on shield. Nalan, Nellen, whatever. Nalan? Nalan a little. Uh, yeah, really excited to have him. And then we also got, of course, a freaking Razor Crest, guys. So, really hesitant to open to open this. I might just snag another. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a like, thumbs up, subscribe if you want to see more. Catch you guys next time. Peace!